An Apple employee has said that Apple, the company she worked for more than six years, is threatening to fire her because of a viral TikTok video she made in which she gives basic advice public about what to do if your iPhone is stolen. The employee, Paris Campbell, has nearly half a million followers on TikTok, with over 17.7 million likes at the time of this video. Until a video last week, Campbell had never publicly identified herself as an Apple employee. Instead, she often shares her work as a comedian and reacts videos to funny and quirky content posted on the app. A week ago, Campbell responded to another person's TikTok in which they explained that they had their iPhone stolen and then received messages from thieves threatening to sell their personal information on the black market. The victim tracked her iPhone using Find My and discovered that it was in China. In the video responding to victims of distress, Campbell begins by saying, I can't tell you exactly how I got this information, but I can tell you that for six years, I've been a hardware engineer for a given company who likes to talk a lot about a fruit. Campbell went on to recommend that you don't remove your Apple ID from your iPhone. Just days after posting that video, Campbell posted another video explaining what happened. She said she received a call from her manager saying she was in violation of Apple policy by disclosing her identity as an Apple employee. However, Apple's policy does not prevent employees from publicly identifying as Apple employees, but only requires them to maintain the image and reputation of Apple in their online presence. Dozens of Apple engineers publicly identify themselves as Apple employees on Twitter, often interacting with the community and sharing their excitement about what they've done after the announcement. To keep up with all updates and top stories in the tech world and Apple in particular, subscribe to this channel and turn on the notification bell. Don't also forget to drop a comment for us below about what you think about this. Thank you for watching, see you in our next video.